now. <sighs> next, uh, next stop, big boy. We we shoot big boy in the face. Whatever this is a new uh, experience. Fighting. <laughs> uh, fighting. Uh, oh, he popped out. Oh. Yeah, we don't have anybody to put in here right now to do the side training, so we gotta go recruit a young but impressionable soldier. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I thought I had someone in mind. Yeah, this this guy. Uh, and then we go to. Well, should we do two? Recruit. I just. I'm interested to hear what this Doctor Tigan thinks the aliens are trying to do in the facility we discovered. The elders hacking up and modifying their armies is nothing <coughs> new, but I've never seen anything <coughs> like what we found in oh, there. Oh goodness! And then coronavirus is getting me. There, we got those two training. <coughs> Fantastic. This dude doesn't look like he's already a psychic. Um, I don't know who does. But uh, let's see here. Why is this training center blinking at me? Taco, stop it. Stop it. Improved soldier bond. Ah, yes. I knew there was something going on. Retrains a soldier's abilities, but then there was also the Wow, jeez. This place got busy real quick. <coughs> Excuse me. Train abilities. Wait, what is this trying to do right here? Oh, it's using the uh, action points. Okay. <laughs> I was <laughs> I was very confused there for a hot second. We do still have some ability points that we can use and we can knock out. But I also wanted to buy <coughs> parkour. Okay. So we've actually bought all of these. Thank goodness. Trains rookies a specific class. Again, we're pretty solid on our layout of soldiers right now. Proving grounds. We needed to choose a project. Bolt caster. Let's do that first. I'll send word as soon as we're finished, Commander. I am uncertain what any of this does, but I'm excited to see it happen. Um, the memorial. Oh, I there's lights. Out there working closely with XCOM. Let's call him Middle Official Stanford. So my friend. Stanford is out there in the wilds for 20 years trying to scrape together this resistance organization. I'm going to listen to this. Much luck. XCOM's in shambles. His best buddy is captured. The aliens blew up their base, and Brad, I mean, uh, Stanford is depressed, right? And, oh, hold up. Oh, looks like this has to be continued. Oh, so he was talking about Bradford. Or central, I believe, as they call him. I'm commander, and he is central. Alright, interesting. We only have three people wounded now, but six unavailable. Two of those are because they're doing psychic training. Two are on an operation. Cool. That's done. What are the supplies? Dude, actually, we kind of need that. And it's not like we're in any rush. Because the Avatar project is just essentially delayed. And we are already low. So yeah, let's do this supply run. Cool. One bolt caster has been added to the inventory. Chance of being stunned on impact. It just get, told us the same information. We might have to throw that on some of our people and... Um, uh, and let them take a swing at it. Frost bomb. Shadow keeper pistol. Hunter's axe. Three days, 25 supplies, 25 supplies. Let's do the ones that cost a little bit less first. Cool. Alright. He's better, she's better at hacking now. Assign a new action. Keep getting those hacks up. Uh, mobility. Promotion. Form soldier bond. Ugh. Mobility. Hacking! Soldiers' XP gains are increased. Ooh. God, that would have been a great one to have in the beginning, but at this point, it's not retroactive, and all of our guys are almost maxed out. At least half of them are probably already at full rank. 
A facility lead gives dodge. A PCS gives hacking. Where is she at? Unless he's still doing bond training. Okay, who else did we have? Specialists. He is the medic, so I'm less worried about him getting his hacking up. Um, wow, I guess just her again. Uh, and then another soldier, so we can send him uh, again to try and get him leveled up. Negates the wounded. We don't care. Go. Keep raising that hacking. Alright, all this stuff is kind of maxed out right now. Bond training. Shadow chamber. Once we get the beam cannon, we'll start that shadow chamber <clears throat> mission. I did order food. It's being delivered, so I'm sorry if uh, you guys see me checking my phone here periodically. I'm just making sure that... They're not, like, outside my place. Oh, no. We have a mission now. Uh-oh. I think... <laughs> um, so, let's see. Increases all intel costs. <clears throat> we get a scientist. Advent stun launchers. Oh, that's probably the one we're going to do. New Australia. XCOM soldiers such suffer greater losses. That gives us supplies, though. And that gives us... have a chance to move. A scientist would be nice. Supplies would be nice, too, though. To their will in combat. Neutralize the field commander. Sabotage a transmitter. I think this ought to be the one that we do. Yeah. Setting course for the Brazilian corridor. Hmm. It's not telling me that my food is ri Oh god, what's going on? Alright, so we all have to deal with this. It takes me forever to get this set up, so what I'll do is I'll pause until I get the team ready that I want. The team is ready. Kind of a little mismatched. We got two snipers, two grenadiers, another <laughs> reaper sniper type, and then our medic with a disruptor rifle. But again, this is difficulty moderate. So, and only six enemies were shown from the shadow chamber taking a peek at it. So I'm not too worried about it. <clears throat> should be should be a real quick in and out. I think this is the one. Oh man, I forgot because I spent ten minutes changing inventories and stuff. Um, we destroy a sabotage a, a transmitter. I don't, I don't think this is the kill the enemy general one. <clears throat> we'll see here in a second. Maybe. After I crack this open. up unusual readings coming from this area and our recon team has confirmed that advent is now operating some sort of massive psionic transmitter oh. nearby shen and Tigan agree if we destroy the transmitter while it's still connected to advent's network their operations across this entire region could be crippled advent has constructed a psionic transmitter in this area tied directly into their primary network our intel suggests destroying it while it's still connected will severely damage their linked systems. Plant the explosives before they have a chance to pull the plug. Oh, I have a new guy. I, I got a stranger danger on my team. I was very confused for a second. Aye, aye. Oh, yes, and he's voiced by the same dude. Come get some. Oh, man, that is some solid vo voicing, voice acting. Oh, buddy uh, and this is this is kind of a whole bunch of B squad people right now heading out so we gotta try and be a little careful really no enemies yet we don't really even have all that far to hold on give me a second here we don't even really have all that far to go oh no I lied oh my goodness we have a huge distance to go what was I thinking I thought it was much closer. I think it's because I've played some multiplayer fights on this map. And... Um... It's smaller when you're playing at multiplayer leg, so... Alright. 
Let's just keep creeping around the outside. She stays hidden, so I'm tempted to push her a long ways up. I can cover it. Cool, cool, cool. Um, is the edge of map this way? Oh no, it is some distance, so we could still probably continue moving all the way down this hallway. Oh. All right. Here's our explosives guy. Let's get him all the way up to there. Moving out. Doing good, doing good. All right, now how about up to there? Time to motor. Moving to Overwatch. Cool, cool. All right, nothing interesting. So, you Right here. Order's confirmed. Moving out. And then open the door. Okay. He's got nothing. So we can at least start working our way through. Oh, look, it's old XCOM. What's on the screen? Oh, I can't really tell. What's on the computer screen? It looks like it's something interesting. I just can't tell what it is. Um, whew, where do I push him up to? Uh, if they're right there, they can be able to get into this room pretty quickly, so I'll have him Position go there. Confirmed. And what do we have that we're running into over here? Some sewer piping systems? Okay. Okay. Alright. Um, who is this? This is my heavy explosives guy. I wonder if I get him to right there. Go, go, go. If he'll be able to see all the way through that building if there's enemies on the other side. I guess not. Oh yeah, he can see through the other side. Okay, no enemies. You, sir? Man, you're going to have to go a long ways, bud. I guess to right hey. there. Okay, what else do we got going on? What else do we got going on? Ch -ch -ch -ch. How much farther do I want to push him up? How much do I want to risk? Because there's still potential that the enemies could be on this side too. Oh man. So risky. So risky. Oh, I'll just, I'll play it safe and just go to there. You are going to have to go all the way, yeah. There's our medic. I'll just leave him in this uh, in this back alleyway right now with our other guy, so that uh, the well-voiced NPC doesn't get uh, doesn't get uh, lonely back here. Looks like my food just got delayed, so maybe we'll be able to power through and finish this this whole uh, this whole area. Let's get her all the way up there, to sir. there. I believe this is our objective. Our readings indicate mm. that Relay is feeding energy directly into their network. If you can destroy it, it may disrupt their efforts to isolate the transmitter. I will arrive. Ooh. Okay. Now it's about to get really interesting. Half cover. That's full. Let's have him bust a move to right Ready here. To location. He can take a shot at that. Not a huge deal, but he didn't see anybody, so we're gonna go straight up to here. Man, with only six enemies. This is pretty interesting. Um, because I haven't seen them yet, so they're either really well grouped together, or we got to be running into one here soon. Yeah, and then the other, I'm assuming, will be on the uh, objective. Um, and then that also brings into light how accurate is that? Good to go. 
is it always fully accurate? Because I feel like on some missions, uh, we have run into more enemies than it says we would. We should, we would or should have. Service. She's got nothing, man. This place is wide open. Let's just have. <sighs> we won't do it yet. We'll we'll keep waiting until potential potentially we see some enemies. Um, where do I want her to go now? I don't want it to be too far up there. Again, there's a whole lot that could be going on over here. So, should I just have her go all the way up to the door? Yeah, I mean, why not? I am trusting you. Okay, we're still concealed. We're doing good work. Everything's fine. We're fine. Oh, that's a good spot. All right, yeah. Move, move, move. Send him to there. Cool, cool. Cool. And what do you got, bud? What do you got that you can go to? He can go all the way over to there, but it's gonna alert them to his presence. So what if I have him run to here so he doesn't try and jump through that dang window and then go around? Really? Come on. Come on. I guess just there, I'm then. Brian Flores. Oh, Brian Flores. Where to send you, Brian Flores? Double time. Double time. Hmm. That's not much, but at least it'll get them back in the same room as the rest of our group. Um, I guess I could have him just fire his pistol and put that thing down. Actually, I don't know if... On Overwatch. Roger. I've got my eyes on. I don't know if it explodes and does damage. So let's, let's, let's hold off on that for a second until we can get her to open the door. And see what's on the other side. Got an enemy squad here. No place for you to go now. Oh, dude. They didn't notice her opening this door? Um, she could Claymore. Right there. Then shoot the Claymore. Now we wait. Dealing eight damage. Let's have her do it. Oof, good hit. I still don't think they know where she's at. Chance to reveal 100%. Ooh, that's no good. So now let's have her run over to here. Moving out. So sneaky, sneaky. I will always find you. Ah, yeah. Enemies are still hidden. Um... Or we're still hidden from the enemies. That's what I meant to say. We are still hidden. They are right there. They're going to start pushing towards us and stuff. Maybe we should all just get on like a solid Where's overwatch. It's got a 73% chance to hit that guy. Not very good. So again, they don't know where we're at. I feel like we should just set up an ambush. Affirmative. Moving out. Affirmative. Covering now. We do need to keep moving because we only have four Solid. turns to get to it. Though we can add some to that with our uh, Overwatching. by shooting the those items. Oof! You can get to there or there. I think one is not a solid. Moving to position. Doesn't make me feel super comfortable, but um, oh well, oh well. Eyes on the prize. Cool, 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 cool. Man, buddy, you don't have much that you can do either. Um. Shit. How about you, Mega? Where are you at? And where could you go? Mega could go all the way over here. You could get full cover right here. So that's two. That's two, which means there's another squad of two out there running around somewhere. Um, I'm just going to move him all the way over. Yeah, 
just like so. And, um, gosh, he's just in that's such a good position where he's at right there. I'm not going to do anything about it. No, nobody gets a shot on him right then. Okay. I mean, they did bad things with their positioning right there that are good for us. I wonder if... Moving to designated position. I get him to move here. Can he throw this through and hurt them? Yeah, he can. Yeah, let's have him do that. It's going to reveal our squad, but... That's going to put down that whole squad of enemies. Oh, it'll... Damn it, I keep forgetting. It puts him in stasis. separation has been temporarily delayed. Heading out. Yeah, I mean, he could take a shot at that one. But uh, what we really need to do is just keep pushing. Because we're not in a great position. position here with the enemies and such. Um, she is hidden. Could I move her to, say, up to there where the other enemies are and take a shot? I am on the move. You cannot run. Yeah, she's got a pretty good angle. She could do banish. Oh, and maybe just put these guys down completely. This world is ours. Oh, fantastic. One of many. They found us. Oh. Oh. Alright, let's pause real quick so I can go grab my food. Alright, so far so good. Um, I was really hoping that she would finish off the other one, but apparently it was seen, but also couldn't be seen. Uh, I'm not bitter about it. Definitely not bitter. I'll get over it. Um, well, he could use lightning hands to put that down, but honestly, I should probably s save lightning hands for when I'd be much more useful to him. Uh, I do want no. to try and take a shot at that Archon if I can't. Nope, I can't. Just not close enough. I could throw out the Mimic Beacon and potentially save her. Uh, I don't know why it would ignore her and go for the Mimic Beacon. Tactically, it doesn't make sense, but... Honestly, the Mimic Beacon seems like a much more delicious target to them for whatever reason. They always kind Roger of that. maneuver around to try and hit that. So, alright, and he doesn't have anything except a shot on that, so we'll get that done. That's done. Uh, oh, he's got a shot at, at the Archon. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, 70%. Well, actually, what if I have him just hop up to here? Moving out! He has now lost his shot on the Archon, because he... <sighs> okay, so he's going to take a few of our Overwatches, yeah, away from us. Sadly. But that doesn't mean that... Oh, he is completely disregarding... Oh, wait, no. Yeah! So there's just something about that Mimic Beacon that they hate, or love, and it makes them want to put it down. Oh, that was a that was a insta kill. Cool. So now all we do is push forward. Not a problem. There is one more group out there. We know that much. Um, I don't know if I want him there because of the fire. So I will hold up for right now. Moving Overwatch. He can go a good distance up to here. We'll see what he sees. Okay, not much. So I'm tempted to have him move up. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, no, okay. That's just more of the beacons. Where is, uh... Where is... <sighs> I mean, he's got fences right there that he could run up on. Yeah, let's have him do that. On the move. Yeah, that's good stuff. That worked out pretty well. And then that means she can move up to here. 
and we'll see what she sees. Two of these. Okay, so we'll just have her take those shots. That'll let us know how many turns we're working with. Cool, we're back at eight. I can work with eight for sure. Uh, and then no reason to not just have you just sprint all the way up so that you're back back in the fight. Alright. Again, we haven't seen anything that makes us worried. So, it's very tempting to have my guy push at least up to there. Uh, and you, I suppose, up to there. Eight turns is more than enough time for us to get there. So, barring some kind of extreme circumstances, I think we're going to be in pretty good shape. Will do. Got it covered. Oh, okay. So, like I was saying, barring some kind of crazy, extenuating circumstances, we're going to be good. And uh, now, we've got these dudes hopping in on us. That is going to make it more difficult. So, because he can't... I'm going to move him to up here, so he's ready to overwatch shoot on those guys with his big fancy rifle. No, 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 no. oops. That was almost a, a waste right there. Uh, I do want you... Gosh, I suppose I could have him... Oh, he's got the big sniper rifle. So let's lightning hands and blast that. So that we can put him um, on overwatch. Come and get some. For that. He does not have cover right there. I'm going to have Head him out. wrap around. So that he does have cover right there for when they come in. That should be more than enough people on Overwatch for when these guys come in. You would think. One would assume. Um, just going to have him use the movement. I think enough of us here are going to be able to put those guys down. That I'm not very concerned about. Leaving them uncovered on the side that they're going to drop in on. Oh, uh, pistol overwatch? Yeah, but he could also do lightning hands and, and crack that thing. Nine turns. Ten turns. Oh, eleven turns. Cool. Alright, now that that one's gone, she could even move up to here. And take a shot. Oh, of course my cat wants in. Here they come. Only two. Oh, that's not a big deal. Oh, that's a little bit bigger of a deal. Come on, Taco. Oh yeah, these guys are in serious trouble. He just put himself on Overwatch, that's it? Slick. Slick move there, bud. <laughs> we could... I could fuck around and try and hack him, I suppose. But we're gonna be able to kill him easy, so there's no point in wasting the time. Uh, yeah, see, we could have done Haywire Protocol on him. Okay, now we can use everybody else to start pushing forward. Yeah, like her. And see, uh... Oh man, I could get her up high, even. As <clears throat> and see what she sees. Hmm, just looks like, uh... Space into a doorway. Okay. We'll reconceal her, and then I think I'm gonna push her up. I go where you tell me. She is now hidden again. And then the rest of us now know that we can get all the way up there, and we're not going to be revealed by anything. Um, there's two ways to get in. I think uh, we're gonna go ahead and try and use both. So we come in on both sides of this thing. We've got more than enough time to get ourselves in position. Let's see if we go here, if something gets revealed over this way. Um, not That's not such a big deal. We'll just take it out. Nice. 
All right, and the rest of us can move up to this doorway. <clears throat> Moving out. Okay. Yeah, that's as close as you're going to be able to get, so I suppose why not? Get her all the way up to that doorway. Him, sorry. Up next to her at that doorway. She'll kick it open. Ooh. That is a... That is a big boy right there. She could do the Le Lancer. She could do the Sectopod. The question I have is... It is still our turn. This wouldn't be a bad time to actually just go off, uh, pop off and take some hits at this guy. They are going to run and move, though. That's all right. We can just adjust fire after that. Um, man, but what does she want to do? The Stun Lancer? Probably the Stun Lancer, right? She's got a 55% chance to just crit, which would mean that she would kill it outright. So let's try that. Damn, no crit. Okay. We'll let them do their movements. Oh, that is probably the best thing you could have done for us, bud. You just did some really good stuff. Let's, um... Let's get to shredding your armor now. Chew that armor up. You can't do much aside from just shooting. So should I have you go in and try and take a shot at the Stun Lancer? I think that's what I will have you do. Good to go. Yeah, he's got a pretty good angle on it. You see how it tried to make me shoot at that thing instead of the guy that I really needed to shoot at? So if you're moving quick, just go in to take shots. Sneaky game. <laughs> All right. Um, I don't think we have anybody else that can really shred armor on him. Uh, yeah, no. So who we've got now is who we've got. Let's see. He's got a mimic beacon, so let's save him. Because if uh, if this doesn't go well, um, let's see here. Death from above. Squad sight. I think we're going to do Deadeye. 87% chance to do 13 to 16. A regular shot will do 9 to 11. But it's 100%. I think let's do Deadeye. Fantastic. Wow, that did a lot of damage. Um, wow, is he really the only one left? I thought I had another guy with a turn. Oh yeah, now there's potential that he's not going to be able to put that dude down, so we almost need to drop the Mimic Beacon. Wow, did I not? Did I imagine? Oh, my third one was, I think, having him move. So I guess we drop another delicious Mimic Beacon and hope that, uh... I hope that, uh, that thing goes after it. Very nice. Wow, so if we would have taken that shot, I think that Overwatch would have, um... What is this thing doing, man? I don't think it's sure what it's doing. That Mimic Beacon, man. Oh. Hoo-hoo. Once again, <clears throat> had girlfriend aggro, but I'm back, and I'm ready to finish this mission. Um... Don't turn around and look at me like you know that I'm about to shoot at you, you big old T-Rex-looking thing. Even though I am about to shoot at you. Finish him off, bud. Oh, he dropped some stuff. We're not picking up any other contacts. Get those charges deployed. 
Oh, man, he's just a little too far away. You know who I bet will be able to get in there in time, though? Well, first of all, you grab this free stuff. Four free items. Oh, two Illyrium cores. Two Illyrium cores. Cool. Oh, and he can take a shot at that. Give us even more time. We're not picking up any more of those relays. That's all the time we're going to get, Commander. Got it. And now, uh, best narrated voice ever is going to plant the charges. Signal confirmed. X4 charges are active. That transmitter is history. Good work, Commander. No one hurt, no one killed, all enemies murdered. And you guys see how it said six, but there's nine here, so it will try and trick you sometimes because they're not on mission. <clears throat> it won't count them, even though they they can pop in. Sneaky, sneaky, XCOM. Sneaky, sneaky. Advent City centers are but one organism. When criminals such as XCOM strike against any single part, they strike at us all. While Advent outreach squads rush to provide much needed assistance to the affected area. Oh, shut up. He does a great job of making me hate him. Our Kudos to that voice actor. Becoming one of our most trusted veterans. It's a testament to our cause. Our friend from the... Do they keep coming back? Are they the same ones? Because I feel like it's a new one every single time. Um, yep, death from above. Congrats on your promotion, buddy. That's exactly what we need. Yeah, he was the lowest ranked. Now he's uh, equal to o Odoherty... Stone Cold Odority? Isn't his name Liam, I think? We got a lot of corpses from that mission. Excellent work, Commander. And a scientist. Your and continue to bolster the resistance movement across the globe. And we countered that dark event. And we have this new very slick looking scientist. What does that say about Oh, it's only gonna take one more day. And then we'll have the beam cannon. <gasps> mm. I'm not sure who out there in Resistance Land caught a clip of that fight today, but I don't think I've ever seen anything like that before. Our pals over at XCOM put a beat down on the aliens so bad, those creepy green tubes they were born in are probably still shaking. To keep this up, we might just win this thing. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> So we finished that, so we could go back to, hmm, that assault mission is what's up next. Oh, we were grabbing these supplies Avengers is what we were doing. We'll knock that out and then we're going to go after that big nemesis uh, enemy. This will prove to be an important Yes! Oh, but we don't have enough supplies to make it. An Illyrium phase cannon? Illyrium phase cannon. Oh, that's for... Yeah, that's for the spark bot. Our titan. Okay. Now. Since that's all done. Yeah, we're gonna take them down to the shadow chamber. Aside from the occasional monument, I don't imagine most of the people in the city centers have ever actually seen one in person. Knowing now that the elders are apparently suffering at the hands of some terminal affliction explains their absence from the public eye. More importantly, what sort of ailment could possibly be beyond their vast curative abilities? All right. That leaves a lot of things done. They're researching the Advent Stasis suit. <sighs> we cannot build... Maybe we can. Maybe it'll be... I'm pretty sure it's going to be 50 supplies to build um, those items. <clears throat> Only one of our people is wounded, so we could essentially jump right into another mission. Uh, let me just check the price on this to see if maybe we need to go, yeah, um, 175 and 150. Oof, big oof. Can I go two? 
the black market and sell enough stuff. Oh, we're also getting supplies for... I'm an idiot. Continue your training, buddy. Just all of it. Just keep training. All day. Every day. Okay. Continue your training, gal. All day. Every day. The Shadow Keeper, although it may appear old-fashioned compared to our latest designs, this pistol is remarkably accurate, ensuring that even the most inexperienced of our soldiers will strike their intended target. There's also a chance they could kill the target and escape undetected. This weapon is unique and cannot be duplicated or replaced. One Shadow Keeper has been added to our inventory. Was that a... Proving Grounds? Yeah, that was a Proving Grounds thing. We don't have the money to do anything else, though. Oh, that's not true. This doesn't cost anything. This frost bomb is 25 supplies. Hunter's axe is 30. Damn it. That's 50 supplies. So I guess we do the frost bomb. We'll get started right away, Commander. I'll send word when the project is complete. Alrighty. We're still waiting to hit for these supplies to hit so that we can make that cannon. Strategic resource located. Delicious. Now. We back out. Go here. Improve the bond. Yes. Confirm. And we go here. We build items. Weapons. Boom. We can't build a... Uh... Oh, we can build one of these, though. Okay. Sure, I mean, why not? We're not going to use our spark for a little bit, so we can we can wait on that. Um, oh, and we get a supply drop in two days, so we really kind of have to rush over and attack that facility. Well, do we, though? Because we the Avatar Project is completely negated right now. So maybe we just chill and wait for there to actually be progress before destroying the facilities? Because there's only two right now. Um, I'll have to think about it, because I'm going to call this an episode right now. Uh, <clears throat> and finish eating my om-noms. GG.